Greetings, Earthlings. Yeah, no. Guys, this is why we don't let me dress up in costumes because I just don't get it right ever. Welcome to this video. It's very, very exciting that I get to help announce a readathon that's coming in September. It is the Tome Infinity and Beyond readathon hosted by Megan Alessandra from Brushing Bookends, as well as a whole host of other really fantastic YouTube creators. I will leave all of their channels linked down below so that you can check them out and their announcement videos because we also were going to get dressed up. And honestly, I'm not really a dress up person, but you know, I kind of went for it even dug out my crafty supplies and tried to stencil stars on my face, but you know, let's go with it. The Tome Infinity and Beyond readathon is happening from the 7th to the 21st of September. So it is a two week long readathon and the wonderful ladies over at Brushing Bookends have created the most amazing setup and atmosphere for this readathon that you could possibly imagine. It is very similar to those choose your own adventure style readathons that have been really really popular over the last year or so and this one is set in space. So the premise of this readathon is that you are leaving Earth and searching for a new home. So you start on Earth and you follow one of four paths. I'm going to pop a screenshot on the screen and I'm going to read you the really wonderful set of instructions that come with this readathon. Information incoming. To find your new home, you must first choose a start ship of your choice. These are featured on your map and have the red exit flight paths. From there, you are on your own. You must travel through space to find the planet that suits you best. We recommend that you visit at least three planets before finding your new home, but the more you visit, the more sure you can be that you have discovered the right place for you. September 7th, 2018. Oh no, is that the start date? Let me crunch some data. Looks like you have two weeks to find your new home starting September 7th, 2018 till September 21st, 2018. Hurry, go, challenges await you. The idea is to read about four books. However, it's a two week long readathon and you can read as many books as you would like to. There are a whole bunch of challenges associated with the different parts of the solar system. I'm gonna read through some of them for you now. So apologies if I'm looking down because I wanna make sure that I read them out properly because you guys know I can't memorize anything. So you start on earth and you choose either ship A, B, C, or D. Ship A, you are you are in this for the long haul, read a book over 500 pages. Ship B, Mars is there waiting to be reached. Uh, read a book set on Mars. Ship C, a short jump to a neighboring planet. Read a book of short stories. Ship D, oops, you hit the asteroid belt. Read a new to you author. From there, the planets have their own challenges. The sun is solar flares. Read a book featuring a solar based event. Mercury, the smallest planet. Read a book under 250 pages. Venus, Favors the bold, read a book with a bold female character. Mars, the Martian invasion, read a book featuring aliens. The asteroid belt, an iconic flight obstacle, read a space opera adventure. Jupiter is the gas giant, read a book featuring giants. Saturn, space, put a ring on it, read a book with circles on the cover. Uranus, read a book featuring some comic relief. Neptune, like the god or planet, read a science fiction with fantasy themes or vice versa. Pluto, planet or not, read a vintage science fiction book, 25 years old or more. I'm really excited about this readathon. You guys know I've been wanting to do a, a science fiction month at some point, and I'm so excited that it's September because it's my birthday month, so I'm gonna be able to read science fiction books on my birthday. Yes. Okay, is that enough excitement for everyone? In the comments down below, let me know if you are going to participate in this readathon. I hope you do, because it's gonna be so fun. I know there's gonna be some Twitter, Twitter sprints and chats going over there and all sorts of things. I'll leave all of the information down below so that you can check it out. I'm very happy to be helping to host this readathon along with the wonderful, wonderful other hosts because I think it's just going to be so much fun and a great way to make new friends here on booktube. Towards the end of August I will be sharing my TBR for this. I'm going to try and set books for each challenge even though I don't think I'm going to read all of them. I'd love to know if you plan on participating. I think it would be really, really fun and stay tuned till the end of the month for TBRs and more information. I hope that everyone's having a wonderful day and I'll see you guys somewhere in space. Bye.